Mom, look, I'm on TV. <laughs> I don't even know how the shit looks, but if it looks decent, if it looks nice, <clears throat> we gonna figure it out and we gonna see. <laughs> okay, that's better. Hi, I'm Priscilla. <laughs> Yo, I'm a freaking mess in this video. <laughs> Hi, my name is Priscilla. Or Cece. Whatever you want to call me. It really doesn't matter. Okay, let's get comfortable. Let's get saucy. So tell me why I was scrolling through Instagram the other day. And I saw this girl. And she posted a picture. I liked it, obviously. And I commented three hard eyes. And I was like, you look great. You look good. Great job. I'm the type of person that inspects <laughs> and I hate that about myself sometimes. And I inspected this. What about this photo that I like? But something was off, something was off. And turns out her lashes were off. That bothered me. <laughs> and I was like, some of y'all really need this video. Anyways, so here I am making this damn video. So I'm not making this video to like bash nobody. <laughs> I'm literally just so bored in quarantine. I'm gonna start a YouTube channel and teach y'all how to put on some fucking eyelashes. So I'm gonna be using simple ass lashes. These are the Ardell Wispies, I think. I really, I used to use these every single day, wearing them to school. That's why all of them are missing. And I hardly wear them now. I'll just put these on and do them, cause why not? Obviously, people wear on like 3D mink lashes and shit. And I only wear those when I do like actual makeup. And I hardly wear makeup now. And these are perfect for when you're wearing on like a natural face. Say you're just wearing on concealer, you get like four wears out of them, I'd say, but I wouldn't wear them four times. Oh fuck! You know what? <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. So you gotta start off with a clean base. Yo, look at me all professional and sh <laughs> I need help. Anyways, what you definitely need is some lash, some mascara. It doesn't really matter what you use, but I really like this mascara, so I'm gonna use this mascara. Y'all you know, would feel like that biatch right now and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna let y'all know. I'm just gonna let y'all know. Once I already put on mascara on both my eyelids, I go right ahead and I do it on my bottom lashes. You might as well just put on your mascara on both your lash lines now and save you the pain later. So that way I don't have to like poke my eye later it makes no sense don't hate on me but i have a lash bag i really don't have a lash bag i never called it a lash bag i don't know why i just called it a lash bag but what's inside of it is what's important so i got some eyeliner in here this like clip sh i need to stop cursing this clip thing everybody's seen this some point or another in their lives and some lash glue there's nothing special in my lash bag i don't really I never ever called it a lash bag in my whole entire life. So what we're gonna do is <laughs> zoom the camera in so you could see every imperfection on my face. Listen, a lot of people might disagree with me on this that you should put your eyeliner on before putting on your mascara. But honestly, it's way easier if you do it after you put on mascara because you have that base. And on top of that, like these are really thin lashes. So I don't want like a crazy eyeliner. So look, I'm gonna like show y'all. I was like, I'm gonna like show y'all and then instantly f***s up. You know, who the fuck does that? Like only, only me, only Priscilla. All right, you get the point. Just like line your eyes. Boy, if you I literally just said I was gonna show y'all how I do it thin every day. And then I instantly just mess it up and do it thick. So you know what? We're just gonna go with it and she gonna be thick. <laughs> yeah, nah, this looks like booty hole, but we're just gonna go with it because self love and we have to love everything we put our minds to. I'm just playing, this looks like shit. Anyways, this is where a lot of people go wrong. So you hold it up like this, first of all, to your face. Always make sure that you get the right side to match with the right eye. So remember, it's just opposite. It's like looking at a body medically, it's right and left, not left and right. I mean, it's okay if you're going for that look, but if you weren't, girl, you look messed up. <laughs> Am I mean? 
I don't really care. This is what that video is for. I would recommend to use a tweezer to get this off, but I don't, I'm a professional. Now, even with very tiny Ardell whiskies like these, you still need to cut off the ends. And, oh, you could even use big ass scissors. Like, this is to really show you, there are no excuses. And you just cut it off. I like to <laughs> cut mine off at an angle. So that way it's very, it's still comfortable, but it's whatever, you don't, you don't need to do that. Some people be complaining all the time that their eyelashes are like stuck in the middle of their eye. Girl, cut them shit. Like, <laughs> So I start off with some lash glue and I put my lash glue on the insides. Like, you let it get tacky. You hear the word tacky all the time. That tacky ass outfit, that tacky ass glue. <laughs> I apply my lashes straight on top of my lash line instead of like directly. I don't know, you'll see. I like to go in the middle of my eyelash first. So I set that part and I really make sure to get it down there mom look i really am a professional oh my god i say the ends and i always work on the insides first because honestly girl like that's the part that's going to bother you the most if you do not focus on it i know my business and i'm letting you know i'm just letting you know okay and this is why i like this thing because like this thing is really dirty I just poked myself in the eye. Oh my god, that hurt and burned. Now, if your actual eyelash gets stuck underneath the glue or lash strip, please take off the lash. Like, just lift it up a bit like I just did. And just place it back on. Like, it's okay. The glue is not going to be dried up that fast. Really press it into your lash line so you can get it. And it doesn't matter. If you need more glue, put more glue. So it really stays as close to my lash line as possible. Like, that's really all y'all have to do. I'm just gonna use this Wander Beauty thing. I don't know what this is. And it's, like, really cute and pink. I like it. It's and that's that. <laughs> that is all I wanted to film. I'm gonna go take a freaking nap, because let's just hope and pray this thing is over. Stay safe.